Hey, welcome back to No Hype Beer Reviews. Unless it's your first time, then welcome. Please consider subscribing. If you do, hit that notification bell, get all the updates. We're set for today's video. The beer is courtesy of Hot Butcher for the World. Thanks so much, guys. Really appreciate it. So I did look up. I have had this beer before, but it was, now I'm forgetting, I think it was three years ago. So I'm like, it's been a while, so I'll definitely re-review it. Um, I love the can art. I always love their can art, but... Uh, Raka Ruwaka Galaxy Mosaic Hop Double IPA coming at 7.5% ABV. Uh, it is not a collab. I will wait for the tasting notes until I have given my thoughts. Um, try to pair my shirt with my glass and the coaster. <laughs> so I did a lot of blue and yellow. Uh, and that's also on the can. Uh, the... Coasters were the only one I actually plan. I just happen to be wearing this shirt today. Uh, but yeah, great can art. All right, definitely looks like double IPA. looks like uh, um, there's, is this one or 7.5? Yeah, 7.5%. Um, Hazy's, uh, you know, just over a finger, not even quite a finger and a half ahead. Beautiful orange color. I mean, it's just, it's an absolutely beautiful looking beer. Let's get into the aroma. I'm gonna start with generically tropical. Okay, now I do get some um, some mango, some pineapple, which is nice. Galaxy has not been kicking out a lot of pineapple for me. I'm actually a little surprised, pleasantly surprised, how much pineapple I'm getting. Strawberries, but like without the tartness, just like not quite confectionery strawberry, but definitely a sweeter side of strawberries. Oh, you know what reminds me of? Uh, strawberries that were like frozen, but for some reason we thaw them out. It's like that kind of a thing. I don't know if I've ever said that before as <laughs> a note. Wow, okay, as a descriptor. Pretty big mango, wow. Uh, some papaya, guava. I don't get things like passion fruit or kiwi or lychee, lychee, I pronounce it. It's one of those things I always say that and then I never look up how you're supposed to pronounce it. it. Smells awesome, but yeah, definitely goes more tropical for me than anything else. A little bit of orange in there, but definitely like those other things, which is cool. Love tropical, I'm sorry, love... um. Uh, orange in IPAs like this, double IPAs like this, but definitely okay if I don't get a ton of that or any of that. Um, and this seems to be just kicking out a little bit. Let's see about the taste. Cheers. Thanks again, Hot Butcher. Hope you guys are doing well. Follows the aroma pretty well. Definitely more tropical. I get some of that pineapple, which is so just, I'm, I'm glad. I'm really glad. This aftertaste, very pineapple-y. Like, I'm just tired. Otherwise, I'd have more energy about how excited I am. Because, like, it's really awesome how much pineapple this has. A um, little bit of a generic melon thing. Not watermelon, more like honeydew, but it's not quite honeydew. But then I do get, yeah, like the mango. I get some, a little bit of orange. I get some of that guava, papaya. More papaya than guava. Good level of bitterness. It almost gets a little zesty that way. Ooh, some dank. It's a little peachy. For something that doesn't have any citra in it, I'm getting some mango and peach, which I usually get from citra. I mean, you can get it from other hops, obviously. Juicy berry. Yeah, like I said, it follows the aroma. To me, it's more strawberry, which is interesting because usually, well, I guess anymore I have been getting strawberry from Mosaic. But uh, blueberry is more of a common one for me. Sweet nectarine, yeah, I mean, I definitely land on peaches, but I think it's the same thing we're describing. And bright tropical, yeah, I'm glad they just said tropical, that makes me feel good. Um, and I don't know if the hops are listed in order of, of intense, or like the amount they put in or what, but yeah, for, for Galaxy and Mosaic being towards the end, I get uh, I do get some classical Galaxy Mosaic stuff. This is killer, I'm, gl I'm glad I, I was going to drink it anyway, but I'm glad I reviewed it, because this is really good. If you guys have some before, uh, thoughts on these hop, hop combo, um, drink of something else you want to tell me about, hot butcher or otherwise, anything, everything, comment section below. Let's get a conversation going. Once you're done doing that, make sure you check me out on Instagram and Untapped. It's No Hype Beer Reviews at both those places. So please like, comment, subscribe, and most importantly, imbibe. Cheers, everyone.